only Danny Rosero, Nemanja Rodoya, and Jake Davis keep their spots. Davis returning to his original center mid position, although not as drastic. Rotation also the order of the day for Vanny Sartini, who makes five alterations to Vancouver's 11. And the ball is kicked into play. Sporting Kansas City and the Vancouver Whitecaps locking horns at Children's Mercy Park. Alongside 12th year MLS veteran Jaleel Anibaba, I'm Eric Krakauer. Both clubs making significant changes to their 11s as matches come thick and fast. But Peter Vermees throwing caution to the wind. Vaposo. Stabbed at it by Kubas, couldn't bring it under control. And this is Jake Davis. Davis trying to place it. Oh, he scored a couple of bangers so far this season, the latest against Austin. Oh, this is trouble now, here. Tangling of players. Vargas at full speed. He's got it, got it to his left. Looking for one. Got it! Oh, in the nick of time. What a challenge. Fantastic last ditch defending from Vancouver. As fast as the two are that are starting tonight for Peter Vermees, you can have a very dangerous situation. But when we spoke to him about what ooh, ooh. collision between Utvik ooh. and Elias Vargas, it was a disputed ball, no malintent. The song. Alenis. Trying to make inroads. Hagada couldn't make clean contact. Well, Javain Brown showed up. Schultz once again back to Jordan Inge Utvik, who's already been painted yellow. Snake bitten by cards this season. That's well played. Galt looking for a runner. Raposo side netting. The angle too tight. The ball a good one, though. Line share of possession for the home side who have a free kick. Well swung in. Oh, what a save! Tremendous instinctive from Takaoka. That was destined for the back of the net. Spot. What he first and foremost expects of you is to stay with the line and make sure you're defending well, but you're going to have a lot of license to go forward with Kyrie Shelton can do a lot of danger with. How about that switch from Utvik? Space here for Burhalter. Sends that one in. There's that from White. Oh, it was a looper. Didn't drop in time. But he's paying off in terms of confidence in Danny Sartini to start him. Hernandez for the third time from the corner flag. There's the header. And that one whistling wide. Danny Rosero. Sided center backs moving out into the channel. What a ball that is. Big switch into a free throw. Hernandez to Radoya. Dominating play right now. SKC. Basong. Agata! Had to contort his neck. Brown with the long throw. Oh, there's a strike. And once again, gold! Oh, a tiny finish. Twinkle toes in the box as the ricochet benefits the Whitecaps. And for the first time since April 27th, Vancouver take the lead. You go straight to Ryan Gold. It's absolutely amazing what he can do. If it's in possession, he can keep possession. But right now, we're talking about scoring goals. He gets his sixth on the season because look at what he does. He stays way more focused than everybody else, has the composure to dribble past Raposo and traffic, and then just slots it home. Look at this. The composure is right there, and then slots it home where you're never going to be able to make that save. He points up to the most high and says, yep, thank you very much. Gold pounces on the loose ball and he's off to the races. Shelton looks for a foul of the Scotsman and he'll go in the book for his troubles. Quiet performance again, like some of the other players for Vancouver. But when he's been up, when he's been asked to, ooh. oh, Cassiano's late to that one. Ooh. Went right through Fafa Picot. There'll be no complaint. Jake Davis, who's put in the shift, will come off. 
one or two boos as well. It was a st tough start, as I mentioned earlier, to the campaign last season. It was overcome. The ball given away. It's called bearing down on goal and putting this game away. SKC short-circuiting in the defensive third. Tim Leibold gifting Vancouver a goal. Here you can see the substitute not really looking, trying to get it over to the right center back. But Ryan Gold says, thank you very much. And he's going straight to goal here. He is never going to miss this. He knows exactly when to take the strike here. And he gets his seventh on the season, second in the game, fourth in three games. Man, he's on an absolute heater. And look exactly what he does. He opens up his hips. And you can see the frustration here. It is really brewing in Kansas City. Because Four minutes were added. Bolido, Shelton. Ball bounces back his way. Ooh. Making inroads in the box. Pulls it back to shot. Takaoka couldn't stop it. He got a touch to it. But SKC pull one back. With time on the clock. And this crowd, somnambulant for so long in the second half, have been awakened. Physicality, we'll see if he's okay. But look at exactly what Kyrie Shelton does here. He uses his experience as a winger to get from his right back position into a goal scoring manufacturing spot here. Polito has a presence of mind to lay it back here and look at what Kyrie Shelton does here. The little in between here and then puts it in the danger zone. And Shawnees does the rest by getting in on very good service. You have to understand that this. A crucial goal it might be a little bit too. Pulls camp into the mixer away by Burrow Halter, and that's it. The curtain comes down at Children's Mercy Park. The winless run is over for the Vancouver Whitecaps.